are like manufacturing quickly like those jobs where they're like shoot like sometimes those guys are cool sometimes sometimes they introduce 19 unnecessary motions to make it look like they're moving quickly watch how quickly i put an item in a bag dude just put it in the bag you asshole well why <laughs> like you're acting like you're moving fast but you're not you're performing kung fu and swatting at imaginary bees when you could just take a thing and put it in the bag like any normal fucking person now you're they're going to put orange in bag oh 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 oh, oh. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's like you just put it in there. I mean, you know who's the guiltiest of that? Hibachi chefs. I yes. know it's not nearly as hard to crack that fucking egg prick. <laughs> make my make my fried rice. You know who I want to fight? I want to get into fist fights with everyone who hands you an ice cream cone and then pulls it out the top. Like that yes. whole scene. <laughs> nope. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nope. You thought no, you no. got the ice cream you paid? You look like a fool. You look like That's a fool again. That's like, here's your $5, and I'm going to that other guy's ice cream stand. No, thank you. I, yeah. I, I straight up want to walk away me. before the sale is made. because uh... No, it, it's all in good fun. That would have been a fun little thing to see. I like the hibachi guys. Like, like especially for I good. like them, but do you think it's as hard as they're making? Every time... When no, you're chopping up the chicken, you don't need to go. Ding, 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 like sometimes ding, ding. they're just hitting the table with a spatula, making noise. You know, yes. but I like when they. If you, I like when they juggle the egg with the spatula when they're like flicking it and catching it over they and put over. It in their hat. Yeah, and then finally they flick it and then turn the spatula sideways so it lands and cracks the egg and the the egg spills out on the thing and then they flick the shell away and start making your fried rice. I like it. So dinner well, the fried and rice show. they make is the best fried rice ever. Always, because so much oil in that. Don't try to flick any food at me, though. I'm not part of your show. <laughs> oh, I'm all about the food flicking. I have the I have the best time. I don't get why everybody at the hibachi place is so shy about trying to catch food. It's fun. It's you, a fun you're little. You're an food easy food. fucking target. They see you coming, they're like, "Ooh, I'm gonna try out some new move." <laughs> Today is the day I finally beat the Yoshi's record. <laughs> I have, no, sir, over here. You sit in the close diagonal chair. <laughs> Do you like very small, small pieces of shrimp? <laughs> you know what I don't like when they like ah, I walk in and they want to like pour alcohol down my throat from nine feet away. Like, no, I don't want this at all. I don't want alcohol on my shirt. I don't want it in my mouth. Here. What is it? it? It's 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 alcohol. It's yeah, some of the stuff they do is alcohol. Like when they're doing the uh, the onion thing and making the uh, it, what's the volcano name? out of it. That's like some kind of Everclear or vodka or something. Because I remember when I was like sixteen. I was watching that happen like at a friend's birthday party at Hibachi. And I was like, what is that? And he was like, alcohol. I was like, no, it's not. And he's like, open. <laughs> and, then, <laughs> and, then he did, and he gave me like a shot and a half worth of whatever that was. And I was like 16. I'm like, oh. he's, he's right, guys. It's, it's <laughs> this this 42-year-old Asian gentleman wasn't joking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. To defy me. Now you get less shrimp than the rest. <laughs> <laughs> That's the other thing, though. They always get the portions right. Like, like there'll be eight people, and they'll have a huge pile of rice. And by the time they're done, everybody has the exact same amount. And everybody's got the right amount of beef and chicken and, por and pork. And, and veggies. Their veggies. veggies are delusionally good because you're like, this is the best zucchini I've ever had. And it's like, yeah, because it's been soaking in oil. Like so that's good. why it tastes so delicious. I'm a big fan MSG. of the hibachi place. I'll tell you what I don't like. You bring a Filipino out there and have that motherfucker start ding 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 ding. ding. That's not it. You're not even from that island. You're I can not. suspend but disbelief. Wheel a Hawaiian. You might as well wheel a fucking Hawaiian out there. All right. <laughs> you might as well have like a fucking like Nate Cherokee Indian cooking me up some curry. Kyle They're is very strict on his casting. I want a Jap in there making that fucking food, all right? Don't you bring me uh, some mm -hmm. Taiwanese. And he only goes to Jewish forgery. doctors and uh, wasp Or accounts. Asian doctors. Yeah, that's how he is. Yeah, they, <laughs> No, like you, I, I'll suspend disbelief for a Filipino person or a Chinese person, but you bring a white guy or a black guy out there, that's oh, not why I, I, I'm paying for the experience. Hi, I'm see, Brent. If I, hi, my <laughs> name's Alan. My name's Alan Stevenson, and I'm here to prepare your hibachi for you. How's that sound? It's like, look, how about you? How about you just take a long walk of a short pier and bring a real Asian over here to cook you get me Mickey my food. Mora out here, or I'm gonna <laughs> fucking beat it. When Kyle yeah. goes to Whole Foods, if that guy slicing his cantaloupe isn't named Noah, he's out of there. Yeah, I won't have yeah. that either. 
If I go to some like legit French <laughs> restaurant and I found out they just named a Chinese guy Pierre to <laughs> fool me, so they could say, "Oh, this is made by Pierre Level Salt Joshua like all their weird sounds in their names. Like I, I wouldn't like that. I, I want, want a, a mustachioed Frenchman in the back. This actually doesn't bother me at all. I don't care if he's Chinese. It's not racism. Japanese. I just want an expert cooking this ethnic food. Like, like I want a white well, guy. I, but but no, you people. said you wanted a Japanese guy. I, there could be experts of any color and race. No, 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 no. If, if I, I do not the cook with honor. I'll t- <laughs> the other day, maybe I already told you this, but the other day when I was when I was cooking those pinto beans and ham hocks. I had I had ordered ham hocks and onions and cornbread mix and, and pinto beans and all this good stuff and, and a black lady delivered it and she goes, "You cooking good?" <laughs> I was like, "You're goddamn right." <laughs> she knows because this is some black people food. It's delicious. They love it. It's soul food. Mm-hmm. I would love. I bet she could have cooked it almost as well as I could. <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't want. Some if I have soul food, food the chef food. better be a black woman. I, yeah, I don't want yeah, some don't, white guy named Kyle cooking my soul food. Maybe you don't. Maybe you don't. You're not gonna get any actual soul in there. I promise you that. But, <laughs> if but you go to I, a I'm nice just... ass Italian place, like the, where, the, where the chef brings the food out to you to explain things, and you're sitting there having your whatever fancy Italian wine and breads, some guy comes out and he's like, "Now this hair is Ville Marsala. <laughs> it's real good. It's, it's one of my favorite of the Italian food. It, it takes you out of it." I don't want that. They should at least have a dummy guy to come out. I'm and Chef to Antonio be. Margaretti. <laughs> <laughs> Borgatti. Yeah. Bor- or, or, Gorlami. Yeah, Gorlami. <laughs> <laughs> Let me hear the music in it. <laughs> Gorlami. <laughs> uh, I see where you're coming from. Kyle. Yeah, I want. I, I want. Get it. If I'm, I'm eating as, as, regional as ethnic food, like give me somebody of the ethnicity and from that region. I yeah. go to. I love Mexican food, but if I go to the local Mexican spot, and there's some white people, some black people, some Asian people, anything but a Mexican fella back there making those refried beans. I I don't trust it. I don't want it. It's funny to counter my own argument. There's a New York deli in Cary. They're all New Yorkers. It's like stepping into New York. They're all in a rush. If you don't order your food with like real economy of words, they get annoyed at you. Like it, <laughs> it's so New York. It's like being home. It's like being home. <laughs> ah, I can't wait to get back to the Big Apple where everybody's a fucking cunt. I was in New Jersey <laughs> working for Cisco and uh, I was recruiting people from Rutgers. I'm in New Brunswick. Mm-hmm. And I asked for directions this before, like GPS was in everyone's phone. And the guy was like mad at me while he was describing it. He's like, ah, oh, go left, go right. You'll see that good building you make a straight or whatever the fuck he said. And he was mad at me. And it was like, all right, I'm home again. <laughs> I held a door open for a man in New York City once. And he looked at me like I, like I was a fucking Martian. He was like, <laughs> I don't even know if I want to go in there anymore. Yeah. <laughs> is this a trick? <laughs> You're going to trick me, aren't you? You're going to trick me? Are they, are, your boys are waiting in there to jump me, huh? Is that what this is about? Uh, not today. I don't need a sub that bad. Today oh, is yeah. not the day to die. Yeah. 